Welcome to our glory globe to viewers of breaking news. Yes, Israel on Tuesday said that its defense forces have regained the control over towns near Gaza as the local television media ran the reports of Israeli towns liberated from Hamas militants. The devastating cross-border assault launched last weekend by Hamas is set to enter its fifth day. Meanwhile, rocket warning sirens blared in the town of as a coastal city located just north of the Gaza border as residents in parts of Israel came out in their balconies to sing songs of patriotism in a mark of support for the retaliatory offensive being carried out by the country's defense forces. Earlier, rockets that were fired from Gaza targeted Tel Aviv and nearby Ben Gurion International Airport in response to the targeting of civilians by Israel, Hamas said on Telegram. AFP news agencies shared a detailed count of the number of casualties and abductions of foreign nationals in the Israel-Hamas war. Here is the data. Thailand, 20 dead, 14 hostage. United States, 14 dead, other missing, abducted. Nepal, 10 dead, 1 missing. France, 8 dead. 20 missing, Argentina 7 dead, 15 missing, Russia 4 dead, 6 missing, Chile 3 dead, 1 missing, Ukraine 3 dead, 6 missing, Brazil 2 dead, Peru 2 dead, 3 missing, Philippines 2 dead, 3 missing, UK 2 confirmed dead, Azerbaijan 1 dead, Canada 1 dead, 3 missing, Cambodia 1 dead, Germany several hostages, Mexico 2 hostages, Colombia 2 hostages, Austria 3 missing, Italy 2 missing, Paraguay 2 missing, Sri Lanka 2 missing, Tanzania 2 missing, Ireland 1 missing, Spain 1 killed, Australia 1 killed. UK Foreign Minister James Cleverly made a visit to Israel on Wednesday, October 11 in a show of solidarity towards Israel, the British Foreign Office said in a statement. The Foreign Secretary has arrived in Israel today to demonstrate the UK's unwavering solidarity with the Israeli people following Hamas terrorist attacks, a foreign office spokesperson said, adding he will be meeting survivors of the attacks and senior Israeli leaders to outline UK support for Israel's right to defend itself. Be on the report, Glory Globe TV, Delhi, Bharat.